When you go through any of Beachbody's fitness programs, whether it's 90 days of P90X, 60 days of Insanity, or six weeks of Slim and Six, your whole body is going to transform, and it goes way beyond just the numbers on a scale. Today, we're going to show you how to measure it by explaining how to take a thorough and accurate set of body measurements. It's so important for people to take measurements, so it keeps encouraging them to keep going with the workout. As they see better and better results, they'll keep doing the workout program, and most of the time, at increased levels. To get started, all you need is a measuring tape, which is included in many of Beachbody's fitness programs, a body fat caliper, which you can find on Team Beachbody's online store, and a friend. Your friend should watch this video so they know how and what to measure. It's extremely important to be consistent in your measurements. This way you know that your measurements are accurate. We've created this process so it's standard. Be consistent. Measure your body in exactly the same places every 30 days, starting on day one. Begin with your arms and work your way down. When measuring your bicep, make sure you measure right at the peak. With Larry, it's obvious. If you don't have a defined peak on your bicep, make sure that you measure the distance between your shoulder and your elbow and take the center point right in between. Now remember, you're going to want to make sure that you do both arms. Next, measure your chest. The proper chest measurement is taken right across the nipples. Your arms are down so that you can get the lats in the measurement. Then your waist. You want to make sure that you're going directly across the belly button. This also includes the love handles, which we so much want to include because we'll be eliminating those after the workout. Now your hips. When taking your hip measurements, it's important to make sure that you're including the widest part of your butt. You want to make sure that your legs are completely together and your feet are touching. And your thighs. Your thigh measurement should be taken halfway between your inseam and your knee. Make sure that your weight is evenly distributed and that your feet are shoulder width apart. And make sure that you do your right and your left leg. Don't forget the calves. For the calves, you want to make sure that your weight is evenly distributed and you measure at the peak of the calf. Last but not least, you'll want to measure your body fat percentage. The easiest way to get that number is by using body fat calipers. To the side of your belly button and about an inch down, pinch as much fat as you can with your fingers and squeeze it with the calipers until the arrows align. Read the number of millimeters and use the chart that comes with the calipers to estimate your body fat percentage. And that's it. Take these measurements every 30 days and keep track of your progress using Team Beachbody's Fitness Tracker Tool. When you finish the program, tell us about your results. You could land a spot in a Beachbody infomercial. Send your story to success stories at teambeachbody.com.